this is Crystal, and I have a small 99 cent haul. Really, there has not been that much at the 99 cent stores, but let's get into what I did get. Um, I absolutely love gummies, and I found the Sweet Tart Gummies, and it says UCLA Bruins, and I am a Bruin fan, so that was pretty cool to find. Uh, these are 8 ounces, and I just picked up one package, and the expiration date on this is... Um, April 2018. That's a great expiration date. The only downside is for nine pieces, it's 110 calories. So that is why I only picked up one package. Um, I did pick up these Triscuits in roasted red pepper. They are natural flavor, which is why I got them. Plus, I do like spicy things. I'm sorry, spicy foods. And this is 8.5 ounces. Expiration date is no. November 7th, 2017. This is always a staple. We absolutely love our salad. And so we picked up more of the Dole Classic Romaine. And we did pick up two packages. The expiration date is November 3rd, 2017 on these. Um, my husband did like this Isadora refried beans, original recipe from Mexico. This is 15.2 ounces. And it's very simple. You just throw it in the microwave and they are ready to eat. And I'm glad that he liked them because he is picky. An expiration date on this is June 2019. I probably should have picked up more, but I only got one. Um, I did get the Sensibly Natural Veggie Chips. They're all natural. And this is three ounces. Expiration date on this is, let's see... Expiration date is June 2nd, 2018, and lately the 99 cent store has been really funky with their pricing because um, I've been picking up, they sell it at Sprouts and it's lentil bean um, chips, and when I went to the 99 cent store, they were $1.99, and they're always 99 cents, so that's why I did not get them, and that's why I settled for these veggie chips. But it's still a good deal because these are all natural. And then, of course, my staple, the lemon juice for the Master Cleanse. Um, I did get two pounds of kiwis. Uh, I absolutely love kiwi, and it makes for a great dessert. And I picked up two boxes because who knows, tomorrow they could be $1.99. So I might as well get them while they're 99 cents. And then I just picked up one pack of this raspberry jello. It's 10 calories for each pack, so that's a great um, sugar-free dessert. And the expiration date on this is November 17th, 2017. And then I picked up these wheat tortillas for my husband. Expiration date is November 13th, 2017. And to go with our salad, um, I got these Kumato Tomatoes by Sunset. This is one pound, which is a great deal. Again, for 99 cents. So they had a really, um, their produce was pretty good, and that's why I picked up a lot of it. And I'm also going to be trying these kiwi berries. I figure since I do like kiwi, I would probably like these berries. And it says the softer the berry, the sweeter the taste. So I'm hoping that these are good. Um, like I said, I did not get too much um, on the food. Oh, wait, I do have two more things to show you. Um, I did grab the last two of the Horizon Organic uh, Cheddar Shredded Cheese because these were 99 cents, and they're 99 cents for each packet. Um, and at the other 99 cent store I went to, these were $1.99. So, like I said, the pricing is all over the place at the 99 cent store right now, and it's driving me crazy. But, um, I figured I would grab these last two packages, because next time they come around, they might be $1.99. So these are just going to go in my freezer. And then I lucked out with my bread. Uh, this bread go starts off at $3.99, so we always pick it up when we can find it. This is a pound and eight ounces, and it's Nature's Harvest, 100% whole wheat, 44, gram, 44 grams whole grains per two slices. Good source of fiber, and it is delicious. We absolutely love it. So I did get that as well. And like I said, that was pretty much um, it for the food section. And then for the non-food items, 
Um, I did haul this yesterday and I did a quick share and it's funny because I just went to the 99 cent store where I picked these up and they are all sold out. So I am glad that I bought in twos yesterday. This is by Basic Beauty and this is so nice and soft. I absolutely love it. Um, this is the powder brush and then it comes even with the little cover and the quality feels really nice. So I'm probably going to be using this today when I put on my makeup because we are going to a big Halloween party and it's kind of ironic because this is the same Halloween party that I met my husband at a year ago. So it's going to be, I don't know, it's kind of fun because we met each other a year ago today at this Halloween party. But anyways, back to my makeup brushes. Okay, so like I said, they were fully stocked in the morning yesterday. I went today in the morning and they were all gone. So I got the blush brush and then I did get the concealer brush and I like how it's kind of angled and again I'm really digging the quality of this and then I did get the concealer brush and they do feel like I said I definitely like the quality um, if you like beyond bamboo then you will definitely like these makeup brushes and again this is the basic beauty um, let me see like I said, I did buy in doubles. I usually do that when I come across great brushes because you never know if you're going to see them again. And I'm not sh I think I'm going to keep these for myself. Um, I have quite a few brushes for my big Christmas giveaway bag, so these are going to be crystals. And then um, I did grab some more of the Honey Bee Conditioner, and I did get two in the Red Ruby Red and one in the pair because I just can't believe that people are not buying it. And again, this is all natural. We all know how much Burt's, Burt's Bees goes for. And then I did get this for a subscriber. Um, she wanted one and apparently they're not at her 99 cent stores. So I picked it up in gold. And again, I mean, look at all that. You have... <laughs> foundation, you have bronzer, you have blush, you have lip glosses, and you have an array of um, eyeshadows and applicators and a mirror. So I hope her mom enjoys that, and I was glad that they were still in stock. And then one of the last things that I got uh -huh. was this big, this is huge, Merry Christmas bag. And this was at the 99 cent store. Only one of my 99 cent stores is all Christmas out. And trust me, I wanted to buy everything, but instead I filmed it for you guys so you guys could see it. And I cannot wait to start using this bag. It is, it was 99 cents, and it is huge. It says Jumbo Treat Bag, 18 by 19 by 3.5. And yeah, this is definitely was worth 99 cents. Um... And really, that's all I found. Um, there's just not a whole lot going on. But again, these are name brands. Everything is a name brand except for one item. Well, actually, three. And that is the Kiwis. Oh, and I also did pick up my um, self-tanner. I picked up two of them. And this is for fair to medium skin tones. And I absolutely love it because it gives you a gradual tan because I am super pale. And yeah, that is all I got. But like I said, my goal is to always bring you a name brand haul, even if it's a small one. Anyways, um, I will film a little bit um, at the party so you can see... Um, our costumes and as always everyone have a great day or a great evening and thank you so much